Hey guys, welcome back to Shining Force. We're in the wonderful, wonderful town of Monarina. Lots of magic happening here. Lots of people and cowls. What a mess. Won't people ever learn not to use Blaze inside? Yeah, I think I watched a PSA about that once, about about using Blaze. Jimmy, are you using Blaze? Har har! You're just in time. Would you like to observe? Yeah, sure, observe what? Good! Sit quietly and watch a master at work. I'm researching summoning demons! Now, I'm going to begin the experiment. I shall summon a dreadful thing from my worst nightmares. Come forth, O creature of darkness, I conjure you forth! Yeah, this is never a good idea. Oh, did he just, like, summon his mother-in-law or something? Huh? You! You, when are you going to stop these tricks? Come home right now! Yeah, he summoned his angry wife. Oops, sorry dear, I'll never do that again. Yes, I'll be good, honest. Aw. Well, he's in an unhappy marriage. Uh, nothing unusual here. Okay, good, because I kind of just had my face right in this weird rabbit angel demon's chest, and I'm feeling a little awkward about that. Gonna get out of this seance area. Experiment assistant wanted. Low rages, high risk. Well, that, um, you're not really selling me on that. Uh, great something guaranteed. How about you? Shh. Oh, we're in a library. Okay, I get it. Sorry, no time. Got to study. Do you guys want to sit down at least? I feel like the music just got quieter too. Whoa. What on earth? Max checks the machine. Max discovers a Domingo egg? I discovered a Domingo egg. All right. Um, I guess there's room in my inventory now because I uh, made room in my inventory. Yeah, that just like, that looks like some kind of terrifying monster suit. Like that would be in a, I don't know, in a really bad 50s horror movie. Um, no, don't use items. Hello, don't usually get guests here. I'm thought to be rather strange, you know. Oh, yeah, well, seeing as you're just kind of staring at your own pillow there, um, I can see where people get that impression of you. How about you, guy who looks like the old man from Zelda? Where am I? Don't tell anyone I got lost. I'm too old to get lost. I think you're just old enough. How about you? Welcome to my research room. I change humans into animals. Care to give it a try? Um... I don't know about this. Very good. Let's start right away. Please stand over there. Uh, now let's begin. Okay. I'm spinning on my own. This is very sciencey and mechanical for the magic town. Oh my gosh, I'm a chicken. Yep, I'm a chicken. Great. Perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Yes, success! What a tasty looking hen! Oh, I'm a hen too? You actually changed my gender? Now that is crazy. If I can change humans to hens, we won't ever have to worry about food. Oh, that is... That's pretty funny, actually. Okay, that is pretty funny. Because, you know, there's still the whole, like... Problem with that being cannibalism. Uh... What's up, hen? Oh, is that what everybody's gonna say to me now? Is that all, uh... Oh, Max! It's nice of you to try to cheer me up, but I'm not fond of hens. Oh wow, they actually like wrote chicken dialogue. Like dialogue to refer to chickens. What in the world is a hen doing here? Shoo, shoo. Wow, they wrote a lot of different ones too. Um, is there any advantage to my being a hen? Like, is this in any way a good thing? Wow, this is a big area too. It's a slide. Oh my gosh, it's a slide. Drat! Not as good a view from down here, but uh, better climb back up. Um, I think I just pushed him down the slide. Oh, he's like Ralphie from A Christmas Story. I'll make it someday. Yeah, wow, you give up quickly. Man, you gotta, you gotta get that Red Rider BB gun. Climb up there and tell Santa Claus what for. Well, what a cute little hen. Go on through. Oh, maybe I had to be a hen to get into this room. Maybe that's what was happening. Hey there. Old Gert turned you into a hen? That's easily fixed. Oh, I see. See, he can change it back without machines. 
I don't think this was like a major feat. This is a basic Baleful Polymorph, which is like a level 3 spell in D&D. Not that, like, level 3 druids and wizards are just walking around. You did well to reach this room. Have you ever heard of a place called Shade Abbey? No, I have not. Is it anywhere? Is it anything like Downton Abbey? It was founded long ago by folk from Guardiana. They know much of the ancients. Okay, um, I'll try to use that information. And what what's that say? VIP Mage's Lounge? <laughs> well, I got fixed by a VIP Mage. A hen went in and a person came out. What a great place to work, huh? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, this room seems to be singed. I, ge I guess this is the room that somebody was using Blaze in that they were talking about before. You know what? I kind of like this town. I kind of like it. It's super quirky. Okay, I can walk up a slide because I'm not an old man. I'm not a wizard. I actually put some points into strength and constitution. Dumb wizards. I actually love playing wizards in D&D. It's far from my favorite thing to play, but it it's really hilarious. I know my duty now, Max. It is to hunt Kane down and make him pay for what he did. I'll fight with you. I'm sure that's what my father would want me to do. Alright, got Henri. Welcome to the crew, Henri. I'm guessing you're a mage because you've been studying here in Monarina, and there are some people, like, who were angry about you in Mon being in Monarina back in Guardiana. I'll be at the headquarters. Vengeance shall be ours! Okay. Yeah, let's get some nice vengeance. I like how it actually shows her walking all the way down the stairs, too, but, like, it starts letting me move. I don't know. Like, older games weren't always good at doing this. My name is Arthur. I used to be a knight. I'm not really a battle type. I like it here. You seem to be doing laundry. Are these your shirts? Are these your two identical cotton white shirts? Well, now what? Okay, so what's up here? Um, the only sane person in this land is Ultrant. Everyone else is really weird. <clears throat> yeah, that one person told me to go speak to Ultrant. Are you Ultrant? You look... Oh, oh, hey. You got uh, Garnet Eyes from Steven Universe. Are, are you a guy or a girl? I really can't tell. Okay, you know what? I'm going to go I'm gonna go with her being a woman. All right. I am Alt... I am Autrant. You wish to find the key to the accursed door before Cain of Runefast? A legend tells that the pool of the ancients below is tied in with the an with the accursed door. To reach the pool, you first need the orb of light from the cavern of darkness. Oh, the light within the darkness. Pretty cool theming. Defeat the monsters in the cavern, and the orb is yours. Then return to me. Max, enter the cavern and retrieve the orb of light. Okay, I'll just do that. Um, is this the way? No one is in that. What do you mean no one is in that? Oh, I was facing the wrong way. The cabin of darkness lies beyond. Only the strongest survive its trials. Well, I'm the strongest, so... Wait, there's stairs down and there's stairs forward. Is this... Up. Oh, okay, I guess we're here. We're here. We made it. Behold the dreaded cavern of darkness. You must defeat the monsters to gain the orb. All right. And defeat the monsters I shall. That's... That's what I'm gonna do. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be in the news. You're gonna hear about it. Oh, we got some bats over here, too. I don't know. Bats always act like they're gonna, like, rush forward and be a huge problem, but... Well, yeah, they'll get here eventually and kind of muck up whatever I'm doing. I'm concerned that that Dark Mage is already on the move. Oh, yeah, I can stand here. That makes me very happy. Blaze... I'll only make it a blaze one, because I'm not going to be able to hit both of them. Yep, okay. Yeah, let's just continue the damage on this one guy. Cool. Man, I like fire magic. It's great. Alright, and that's a, that's a skeleton. That's a skeleton, and I guess in that chest is the Orb of Darkness. There's another chest down there, too. Okay, I think after I finish this battle, it'll go into non-combat mode, and I'll be able to deal more with that. Max, can you take out a zombie for me? Can you do that? Oh, wow, that zombie was too quick. It's a fast zombie. It's like the... 
I guess that makes it like maybe like a Half-Life 2 zombie. Not the first Half-Life zombies you see, but the ones later, like after you get the shotgun. We don't talk about Ravenholm. Oh no, a zombie. Oh no, I'm gonna be zombie too. And then Max was a zombie. No, Max, you are the demons. All right, Gort. Gort, get up there. Oh, and there's a Dark Mage. I gotta I gotta keep that in mind. There's a Dark Mage coming for me, but maybe next turn, if they, like, keep their position just right, I'll be able to hit them all with a Blaze 2. That would be fantastic. All right, what do you, what do, you do, Henri? What's your deal? Uh, you also have Blaze, so that's cool. Uh, that's very cool. Good to know I have a whole nother load out of that. Um, Luke's gonna stay here. Um, let's just look at these stats here. You have your level 3, attack of 16, defense of 4, movement of 5, agility of 7, but do you have, like, a magic stat, or is that the same as your attack? Um, no, I guess it's just about what kind of magic you use. I guess. Oh, the poison in Max's body inflicts two points of damage. When did Max get poisoned? I guess the zombie poisoned him. Aw, oh, man, poisonous zombies. I, I'm blighted. I'm I'm blitten. Bl blitten? Would that be a good way to say this? All right. You ready? You ready? I don't think you're ready. You ready? Let's get a Blaze 2 up in here. Yeah! Light him up! Light him up! Fire! 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 <laughs> fire! Okay, it's so not really killing guys, but doing a lot of damage to guys. Um, I've pretty much resigned Tao now to get the crap beaten out of her in the next round because I put her in front, but it was worth it for how much damage this is psyched to do. Yeah, this isn't good at all. This is not good at all. Ah, oh, that's a good hit. That's a good 8 damage. Good damage on... 8 damage on Tao right out. Okay, well, can you take out this mage? It would be great if you could take out this mage. Please, please do that. Oh, thank you, Ken. Thank you, Ken. Ah, Ken, you've made me the happiest general in the world. Okay, Henri, you're working with only 13 MP as opposed to the 21 that Tao has. She, she was only level 6 at the time. Oh, and you only have Blaze 1. So, no, that... I don't... I don't need to waste that kind of magic right now when he only has 3 HP. I, I don't need to do that. That That's fine. That That's really okay. Really? Snipers? You don't want to do anything? The snipers don't want to move. They are, they are too lazy to just take one step forward and attack my completely susceptible mage. What's wrong with them? Okay. Well... Zambi is gonna continue swinging at Max. I should probably get some heals on him soon. Uh, actually, yes, I really should do that. So, Gort, why don't you take care of this threat right now before he can finish off Max? Huh? How, how's that? How about we do that? All right, Gong, can we please get you to heal Tao? Because I'd like to keep her massive area raising damage for as long as possible that would be great i guess there's other spells they can learn too do they learn them over time or do i have to buy them spells like like it's final fantasy 3 or really any early final fantasy i don't know why i picked 3 i guess because final fantasy 3 is the oldest final fantasy game that i've actually beaten i've played final fantasy 1 yep that's gonna be more poison uh do i want to no, I'm gonna save the rest of her magic power. I'm gonna save it a little bit longer, so... Um, you can stay where you are, though, Tao. You can... Yeah. Tao, you can stay right here. Yeah, that that's where I'm gonna be, want to be using more Blaze. That or on these bats, because... I bet if I can get these bats at the right time, I could really just completely mess them up. Alright, return fire, Ken. Ken has so much HP. What is that all about? I like it, though. I guess maybe Ken's supposed to be the defensive knight? I think that guy Archer is... I mean, uh, Arthur. Not Archer. Arthur. I think he's supposed to be a different knight. Um, nah. Henri, you stay put. Lo, you also stay put. Here we go. Hans. Perfect. That'll do. Show him who the real sniper is, Hans. 
Boom. He never would have made it in the motherland. Ryan lands a fine land once more. So just while I'm on this train of thought, can we get a fantasy world where the elves, where elves are exclusively in Germany? So like the mystical, practically otherworldly elves and their immortal, ageless elegance all have thick German accents. Nothing against German accents. Uh, I mean, I like Germany. Germany's cool. Germany's a cool place. Maybe that wasn't the best place to put Chris because now she's gonna get... She, she's gonna get flocked by bats if the bats are smart enough to actually move up and attack her, but we'll, we'll see. Alright, now the bats figured it out. Now the bats are on the move. Okay. Children of the Night, what damage they do. Not very much, especially considering that that's a mage. Had the perfect chance to attack Chris, but is gone for Max instead. I guess they understand how the game actually works, though. It's not like Fire Emblem, where they can screw up my run by killing somebody. Um, the only way for them to screw up my run is by killing Max. So, yeah, let's just... I'm, let's just let them do that. If they want to take forever to do damage to Max, that's just fine. Um, I... And I'm going to make that all the easier for them, because I'm going to move Max right up into the line of fire. So, I'll show you. I'll counter your sensible strategy with a completely idiotic one. Especially because he's poisoned. Yeah, this wasn't smart, but, like, I want to get things moving. That's, that's the kind of strategy this is. That's a let's-get-to-the-point kind of strategy. It's, it's that kind of strategy. Uh, Gong? Actually, no. Gong, just stay here. Gong, punch it. Punch a gong. Punch a gong. Good punch, gong. Just, like, Shoryuk and a bat out of the air. That That's great. That's perfect. Good on ya. Okay. I'm gonna do it. I'm not, I'm not gonna get a much better shot than this, so... Oh, wait, but I think... Oh, that would hit Max, though. I don't want to hit Max. I don't want to do that. Okay. Just, just stay put, Tao. Just, just stay put. Okay, so now there's a bat kind of trying to separate my group here, but that's alright. Oh wait, no, Gong, stay there. Gong, keep punching. Keep punching, Gong. That's your only job. That's all I want you to do, is just keep punching at bats. Good job. You will harden your knuckles on the hides of flying mammals. Oh, we got over here on the right now, we got our, like, heroes of Middle Earth. We got... Max is Aragorn, and Hans is Legolas, and uh, Gord is Gimli. And I don't know, I guess, uh, I guess Tao is kind of like Arwen, right? Yeah, I think so. I think that makes sense. Because apparently she was awesome. They, well, no, they made her more awesome in the movies, and I approve of that. Because the books just, I guess they were trying to make it, like, medievally realistic of, like, them not expecting women to, like, fight or anything like that, but nowadays, like, no, we want some badass woman characters. So I like all the stuff that they added with Arwen in the Lord of the Rings movies. Um, she was gonna be in even more. I think she was going to be... They even, like... There's footage of her at the Battle of Helm's Deep that they cut, and it's not even in the extended edition or anything, and I'm kind of disappointed about that. I, I, I want to see her in that battle. I also want to see me gaining a little bit more levels, because I'm really interested to see what some of the promoted units are like in this game. Wow, that poison is just really sticking with him, too. I bet there's an item that heals poison, and I'm just not paying enough attention. But low, heal him up, and then everything will be just fine. Alright, the bats are cleared. Um, I would need an antidote. That, that's the item I would need to cure that poison for him, and I don't have any. I don't have any equipped to Max. I'm sure I have it equipped to someone else, so... Actually, why don't I just start looking through my items now? Okay, yeah, it's the give option, right? So we got healing seed, defense potion, so I know Gong doesn't have it. Okay, so that's how I'm going to spend my turns while I move forward. So now for the real question... How do I want to draw out all these dark mages who are surely capable of just completely wrecking my crap if they get out here? Um, yeah, I should not keep Max that close to the proceedings. Alright, you're gonna... Wow, when are you guys gonna move? 
when are you guys... What do I have to do to get you guys to actually move? Should I actually go up right now and start punching you? Sure, I mean, if you're gonna let me take the fight to you. Silly mages. The point of being a wizard is to not let people get up in your face with a broad axe. But, okay, let's drop some blaze on that blazer, huh? Let's do it. Henri, show your power. Not bad, not bad at all. You do your kingdom proud, Henri. I keep wanting to call her Ari, you know, like the nine-tailed fox. So far, the mages have just been letting me come in and pummel them, so waiting for that. Chris, why don't you move back to be with Max, because I think I think you're the one I'm going to need to keep using healing on him in case he takes too much damage from poison. Lo is now out of magic power, so I can't depend on him anymore. Wow, yeah, these mages, those mages... Yeah, too little too late, man. I mean, you might take out Gong, but besides that... Nope, couldn't even take out Gong. Can't take out Gort, can't take out Ken. Yeah, you guys should have thrown fireballs down while you had the chance. It's too late now. It is too late, baby. Yeah, it's too late. Um, the guy who did the most lasting effect for this entire fight, I think, was actually that zombie. He, he's the one who's actually making some kind of progress towards beating me. That poison damage, I've been dealing with that my entire way through this dungeon. Uh, okay, Gort. Uh, that skeleton doesn't look that strong. Okay, I'll figure that out next turn, but first I should really take care of the guy who can hit three enemies at once. He's managing to just barely hold on. I gotta tap him with somebody. Let's... Let's tap him with Ken. Just gonna attack the first chance I get because I'm not good at keeping track of what order my characters are gonna move in. I'm, I'm not good at determining that, so when I get a chance to attack, I'm gonna take it. Okay, um... Henri, do you want to try and finish this off here? Yeah, I'll give you a shot. Uh, yeah, fire magic. Fire should be good against skeletons, right? Oh, wow. That skeleton is ready to go. Seven points to a skeleton. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, skeleton, calm down. Calm your little lime green shorts. And, okay. So, this is how the Princess of Guardiana got assassinated. Up, oh, the future of Guardiana is doomed. Guardiana, more like unguarded Anna. Gar unguarded Henri, uh, yeah, that was, that was pretty forced. The same way that this arrow is being forced into the skeleton's eye socket. See, it does, like, it doesn't matter, because she'll come, come back. She got a little bit of experience, I got to use some attacks on some people, so she got experience. It's all good. Gong, wait here. That's a pretty big backpack Gong's got. What, what all is he carrying around there? I would like to know. Yeah, poison damage still going there. Uh, Ken? Can we do a little bit of chip damage? A little bit of chip damage to him? Okay, not bad. And... Alright, I think this is gonna be Gort's victory again. I, I'm i not sure about everybody else, but I plan to carry Gort through this entire game. Also, I've just noticed I don't have Luke in my team anymore. I think I... What, what is the max party size? 12? I think it shuffled Luke out of the party. So... I have to decide if that's what I want, because do I really... Do I really need three healers? I know Gong is like an off-healer. Yep, poison, poison, poison. Okay, Hans! That's gonna be like one damage, though. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere, skeleton. Oh! Took out Gort! No! No, my dwarf! He was my most favorite dwarf! How could you? He's like, one of the only characters in my party right now I actually know I want to take into the endgame. Everybody else I'm kind of not positive about. Okay, I might as well, I might as well keep healing- Oh, right, you don't have enough AP. AP. Okay. <laughs> Low, hit him with a stick. I know he just killed two of your comrades. I know he's more powerful than all of us combined, but hit him with a stick. Hey, he leveled up from that, though, so it was a good idea, technically. 
by by default. You doing okay, Max? Taking a lot of taking a lot of damage there. Okay, Hans, and I think Ken's gonna finish off, unless Hans can double attack somehow. Or critical hits. Are critical hits a thing in this game? I don't even remember. Well, you managed to reduce my numbers. Okay, it's maximum of 10, I guess. Or, wait. I have 7 here. Maybe each map just has a different number of characters I'm allowed to bring in. I don't know. I should actually look into that. But yeah, skeleton defeated. No, it cannot be! Or, can we... Okay, attempting a Skeletor here. No, it cannot be! After all these centuries! <laughs> Max, the Orb of Light! Wow, that's a surprisingly similar sounding voice that I use for him. Max, the Orb of Light must be written... Be within that chest. Take it quickly. Okay, what? what's the rush, man? Why do I have to take it so quickly? I got the Orb of Light. Okay, we should plunder some of the other chests while we're here, too. And we got a power ring here that... That must be something good, right? And what's up here? We have... Another wooden staff. Good, just what I need. More sticks. One more. I, I almost didn't see this one up here. Uh, search. There we go. Discovered a power staff. Well, that's a much better stick. So is the power staff not also wooden, though? I guess just they couldn't think of anything else to say about it besides that it was wooden. Okay, let's uh, move these around. I want to give... Um, I want to give this to somebody a little stronger. I want to give it to Tau, actually, so give Max's power staff to Tau. Okay, and search this one. Medical herb. Good, good, good. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get back to Macarena. So if that's the cavern, what what is up here? Oh, 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 hey, hey, it's an eye. This much must be the pool. This is the pool that I've heard so much about. Well, this pool isn't all that exciting, to be honest. Was I supposed to... Wait. Was I... Su okay, I think I need to use the Orb of Light there, but I think I need to talk to uh, Otrent first, or whatever his name is. Hey. Hey, I got your thing. Use the orb at the pool... Oh, right. Use the orb at the pool behind the secret door below. Okay. So, you demanded that I come out and show you the orb so that you could tell me to go back in. What, why, did, why couldn't you just give me all the instructions before? Because I would have forgotten, let's be honest. Use Max, use that Orb of Light. Oh, oh, hi. How long I have waited for this summons. Max, you are a hero without peer. The legacy of the ancients is an evil being that has been sealed away for 1,000 years. Dark Soul now searches for the key to unlock that seal. You must stop him. Um. Okay. I will. I guess. I. That didn't really. I mean, I already knew that I was gonna stop some guy named Dark Soul. That didn't really help me. The Orb of Light has chosen you, Max, to battle the evil that threatens Rune. You are truly the. I keep changing your name. You are truly the servants of the powers of light, the Shining Force. Cross the sea from Win Rindo and go to the eastern continent. You must stop Kane. Okay. I'll just do that. Were you blocking my path until I finished with Otrant? I is that what was happening? Now all shall know you as the Shining Force. I thought everybody did know me as the Shining Force. Didn't I, like, leave my hometown already knowing that I'm the Chosen One? That's, like, the first thing they told me in the game. Just kind of fitting this in here, but I read up a little bit on what I was doing, and I know that I should not leave Monarina before talking to this guy one more time. I want to fight again. I can help you against Runefast. I'm coming with you. Arthur jo joins... Arthur... Arthur joins the Shining Force. That's what he does. I'll be at headquarters. Call me when you're ready to go into battle. Alright, so I got another knight. As if I needed the Shining Force headquarters smelling so much like horse. Alright, well, thank you for joining me for the Caverns of Darkness. I'm the Comic Foil, and... Well, we still don't have a ship into Rindo, do we? I don't know. Let's go back to Rindo, see if there's anything we can do about that.